G'day guys. Okay, so I'm outside of uh, Coles in Upper Coomera and I've jumped out of the van and there's somebody's credit card uh, sitting on the ground. So it's a Commonwealth Bank card, so I've uh, jumped on the phone, uh, gone through the processes of you know reporting a stolen, stolen card. Um, got to uh, the queue and it said it's a 60 plus minute wait time. Um, look, I'm sure the banks are really busy given the uh, uh, what's happening in the world at the moment and uh, uh, Australia with uh, I don't know, some crazy number of uh, people in uh, in lockdown and number of calls they'd be making. But all that aside, uh, it makes you wonder if you've lost your card and uh, you've got to wait for an hour to report it. Uh, Assuming that um, you can't jump online and you've gone through all those processes, but say if you knew you could do that, like, I mean, you, you could imagine the number of transactions that somebody could be making out there uh, just by doing your tap and tap and go under a under a hundred bucks. Gosh, you could rack it up pretty quick. But um, I, I went into Coles and, uh, yeah, mentioned to them, uh, they uh, didn't care uh, in the slightest. Um... Not that it's their responsibility anyway, but um, I was just more uh, uh, dumbfounded that um, you know someone's cards cards in the car park, and it's an hour wait to uh, to actually cancel it if you if you ring through to stolen cards. Um, but on the way out, there was this lady that turned around and said, "Oh, I I overheard you saying that you you found a card that was a uh, not signed. Um, that's something that I do can." can I have a look at the card? And I said, oh, you, you don't really look like a Frank to me, so it's so it's probably not yours. And uh, she sort of backed down uh, from that, but, um, and I made the joke that, you know, the, the lines are getting pretty blurred, but she didn't, didn't really look like a Frank to me. And uh, the card's not in Frank's name either, it's the card's in Fraser's name, but, um, cause, you know, the next thing it'd be a case of, oh, um, um, yeah, Frank, oh, that's my husband, it's his card, I was using it to get the milk or something. And you're thinking, how hard is it to, if you think you've lost a card, wouldn't you open up your purse, like how many cards do you have to see if one's missing? Do you not know how many cards you, you've got? Like, uh, I suppose that's possible, but more than likely you're thinking, I, uh, you just want to take the card. Uh, and even if that's not the case, you're thinking, Gosh, there's a potential scammer here. You just go and like you hand over the card to to uh, uh, for to check a name, and then she disappears with the with the card. Like, where do you what do you do with that? Um, but the good news for Fraser is that um, I am just going to take um, this card down to a police station, and uh, I'm sure someone will be in touch. All right, catch you later.